inner ecology our physical body system are aligned with our emotions thoughts and spirit they work as whole and we think how we feel how we act and how we work with the people we work with the way we think and act will reflect how we work towards our environment how we make action towards our environment inner ecology represents our inner self for us to take charge of ourselves the way we think and feel it is important to care our mental health our soul and our emotion because it will affect the way we act towards our surroundings we have peace if we have peace of mind to think or even clear mindset to all things around then we can take actions to all work without stressing other people and affecting our job we the way we think will reflect our actions and we cannot have a progress and and work good without taking care of our inner self care for and relate with non-human beings while spending time with nature trying to connect or spending time with nature caring our trees and non-human beings our surroundings will help our inner self our inner ecology to understand what we should do and able to work for our environment and able to help our environment make actions that can help yourself more productive in everyday life trying fitness activities or exercising and and eating healthy foods will help you develop or redeem yourself and recharge yourself for you to think where you have to think clearly and distress from any stressful things around you in that way we could think clearly for clearly to help our environment to because before we should help our environment or before we act towards one another or our surrounding the the best thing to do is first we should we put ourselves first we should clean ourselves first we should clear our mind to absorb some new things that we should do so we it could be we could work without any distractions take time to reflect yourself self reflecting will help our mind emotions and body absorb positive vibes to our surroundings practice meditation to have clear thinking and avoid conflict between yourself and your actions meditation will help us to clean our minds our soul because the way we think will reflect our actions to be more careful in our environment and kind to our surroundings become more energy efficient and learn to recycle your own energy being more energy efficient or learning how to consume our energy from ourselves will definitely change the way we think and act towards our surrounding being aware of rights needs and well-being of a future generation and explore how we can support this in our actions becoming aware of our rights and needs of being a person or being a human will help us develop our critical thinking to more efficient or more productive or progressive in how to consume and and protect our environmental resources our surroundings and our nature because the start of being a good or good citizen in our community starts with our own self we are imparting our knowledge and skills on how to protect our environment to the future generation and the wheel of inner ecology starts from ourselves outer ecology focuses on taking actions and helping our environment outer ecology represents how we can make actions that can help our planet earth educate ourselves about the resources that we our family and organization utilize to, fulfi- to fulfill and sustain our needs 
First, the needs to educate ourselves is the best way of practicing outer ecology, not just for ourselves but also to our family. In that way, we learn how to utilize and care our environment. Practice proper waste disposal. Practicing pro or doing proper waste disposal is one of an example of outer ecology. Why? Because we take actions. We work and we make action to help our environment, to help our nature, to help preserve and protect our surroundings. Reduce, reuse, repurpose, and recycle. Reduce, reuse, repurpose, and recycle is also the best way to preserve our environmental resources. Not just that, but also we tend to protect our environment, ourselves especially, because we make actions in how to preserve and how to avoid any diseases, any um, pollution around. It is a useful way to create change. Next is collect and use rainwater. Collecting rainwater or reusing rainwater is the best way to practice outdoor ecology because we are being sustainable and practical on the things around that we could use. Create organic vegetable and fruit garden. Creating an organic, organic garden will have a big help to our environment because we avoid any chemicals that can ruin our, so, our, our soil. In that way, we can clean our environment and we reuse the the organic materials that we could use to our garden we reuse the garbage or waste that has been thrown and we have clean and safe environment if we create or make an organic garden garden and every time we plant vegetables or fruits just to have a sustainable life Support local business and organization that care for our planet. Supporting local business and supporting those organizations that have care to our planet is the best way to apply to ourselves, to make actions of that. Because we're not just helping ourselves, but we're, but we're helping our community to have a sustainable lifestyle and healthier living. I'm Aze L. Ragpa, second reporter of Group 9.